Hey guys, this is Frank from Tested. I'm here at Monster Palooza and I'm here with Pat McGee. Now, every year when I come to uh, Monster Palooza, I love like everything that he's got at his booth. Um, he's got a lot of really cool replica stuff he does for clients, like Universal Halloween Horror Nights. And then he's got a bunch of original stuff, which I love, like all these little things. Pat, let's talk to you about this stuff. Yes. So when you do something like this, from this is from Krampus, right? Krampus. So do they give you like a whole bunch of reference and then you have to figure out how to recreate it or you have to? No, exactly. Yeah, the, we got great reference from Weta that was sent to Universal to recreate this. So we got tons of reference for this. For sure. so you just do like a big giant wed clay sculpture and then? Huge wed clay sculpts, big fiberglass mold. Is this, what, uh, is this latex and polyfoam? What do we got? This is actually fiberglass, okay. the hard part, and this is all latex and polyfoam. Yeah, down and dirty. Cool. What do you uh, what do you use to make the little drippy wet stuff? That's a trade secret. Oh. You can't get it. No. Ah. That's just a urethane. Oh yeah? Yeah, it's a BJB urethane. Yeah? So you just like drip it till it just gets to that right yeah. nice point and then it makes it well let it get really hot and throw it on at the last minute and you get your nice drips. Cool. Yeah. This stuff looks great. And I like other than the stuff that's these gorgeous replicas, you have your original stuff too. Yep. Um, so I actually have uh, they're a 10-year-old, I have 10-year-old uh, twin boys. This yeah. is their Halloween masks yeah. one year, so just made into a display. And you made that other display over there, yes. which is their costume that they wore at the costume contest here last year? Yes. And now you made a display of it? Yes. What What inspired you to make that one? That one particularly? Uh, well, they're twins. Yeah. So ever since the, I knew I was having twins, I wanted it one year to stick them together and make Siamese twins. So. That's awesome. I, they were at the right age to where I, they, I knew they'd tolerate doing that. That's so cool. Now, you started making all your own little individual things. Yeah. What kind of sparked this? What sparked this is basically Monster Palooza and the audience and the crowd knowing these are big ticket items, some of which I can't sell, some are a high price for collectors. I thought I'd do nice little fun original pieces at an affordable price. Yeah. And uh, I started getting into animals and adding eyes and just kind of coming up with fun little trinkets that people now, can these, take home. Are these resin castings or silicone or what do we got? We got some are resin and then some of these that have eyes inserted are actually like a self-skinning urethane. Yeah. Uh, so a combination of resin, urethane, no latex. So everything should last a little longer. Cool. These things, I love this little rabbit one. That yeah, that's urethane so and we got a little fur work on that. That's gorgeous. So just to be a little different and then, you know, have a small take home item that someone could take home with them. Cool. So there's some more things you could see here at Monster Palooza. So next year, you guys gotta come.